Hey, I'm Quinn Conyers, and I just got done finishing up Power at the Podium, a two-day event where I taught speakers and entrepreneurs really how to boost their business with speaking, more specifically, how to use their voice in business so every time they open their mouth, they can maximize and also monetize speaking opportunities, and it's been incredible. I've literally watched people transition from a public speaker to a powerful presenter literally within 24 hours. So I'm just so excited to use my gift to be able to serve these entrepreneurs and speakers so they can really begin to be the spokesperson for their business. So this is the second Power at the Podium. Event. Correct. And we just heard from nine incredible speakers. They all just left testimonies. They're all on fire. They're all excited. Like, what are you thinking now relative first Power at the Podium, relative to now second one? Like, how, what is different about the first two experiences? And what are you thinking now in terms of 2020 for the third? That the first one was an idea, and I was hoping people understood it. This was confirmation that what I'm doing, that I'm operating in purpose. I feel like where I am now is where I've always wanted to be. I've always wanted to speak. I've always wanted to train. And I thought that someone else had to give me that opportunity and say yes to me. But what I'm realizing is I can create my own platform, say yes to myself, and still impact lives. So this is almost like a surreal moment for me because it's like, did this just happen? People really invest in me on a, on a higher, different level. So it's a really euphoric feeling. Now you have an academy model, so now you have an opportunity for some of the speakers to work more closely with you. You just tell, what are you, what are you thinking as you get ready to start serving speakers in 2020? Like, what are you hoping to um, do with those that one on one approach that you couldn't do before? So it's really the preparation part, because a lot of people are very one-dimensional when it comes to speaking. They think that if you're just a good speaker, that is enough. So my whole thing is with the academy, beyond the podium, is teaching you really how to create your sales sheets, your your um, your one sheet, um, really what to say to get people to actually convert. Because most people are great speakers, but if you have a product or service, you have trouble converting. But if I talk to you one-on-one, -on -one, we can figure out what is your master message, how we can, can we communicate that verbally as well as on paper that get people to say yes to your coaching program, yes to doing business with you, yes to coming to your live event. Because at the end of the day, if you are making an offer and no one buys, after a while you get discouraged. You ask yourself, is this what I really should be doing? And you give up on speaking and that's what happened to me in 2014 I knew that I was a great speaker but I wasn't a great converter and the result of that was me giving up and really losing my voice I would say for a few years because I was so blindsided by making this offer and no one signed up and I don't want anybody else to feel that way I want them to know that their voice has value and they can use it on their own platform as well as other people's platform and creating a strategic individual strategy on how they can excel in their own way is what I want to do. So Quinn might have her way through doing hosting her own live event, but I might work with somebody else. They can go speak on other stages and still have, you know, a good thing with conversion. I, love it. I have one more question. Sure.